Hey everybody. Okay, so we're getting right into the video. I already did my acrylic application. Um, I tried recording that part, but it just didn't work out. <laughs> but I just wanted to share the art on what I did with on my uh, left hand. Um, and this video is going to be doing my non-dominant hand. I am right-handed, but I have to say, like, every time I use my left hand, I feel like my left hand does a better job than my right hand does. And that's just so crazy to me, honestly. But anyways, I am definitely doing some ombre art, some spider web art, um, adding some stones and definitely doing some 3d acrylic flowers and then also some 4d sculpted art as well i freaking love how this set came out i just i just love it so much but obviously as you if you haven't guessed yet but this set is for breast cancer awareness month october is that month Pinktober, and I am definitely doing this set to represent those breast cancer survivors and the ones who obviously are resting in power as well. Shout out to those families, shout out to you if you're involved, shout out to me because I know I have family members involved with that as well. So I definitely wanted to do something to represent. I needed it to be flashy and sassy. I needed it to catch people's eye, you know? <laughs> and I also wanted to do some, you know, some, I wouldn't say this is extreme nail art, but a lot more than what I usually do that if you're, if you're returning to my channel, as you can see, this is gonna be like probably one of the second, ones that are really loud in art <laughs> and i love being uh, you know flashy with my nails um but for the most part of this video you're gonna be seeing me and how i do my techniques and also this set that i did is also a pop-off method now and i have a video of pop-off method of, of the pop-off method so if you get a chance go go ahead and scroll down and take a look um and this time I did do the same thing, except the only difference is um, I use the McCart peel off base coat and I've heard some nail techies that didn't really have a good experience with these. Um, with, I mean, with the McCart base coat, um, I guess they feel that it rips like their nail off or damages it. But the way I do it, I make sure I just cuticle prep. I don't etch the, the whole nail because obviously they'll be on their way longer. I mean, you could do that if you want your nails to be at a certain, you know, distance, meaning like you want them to last a certain amount of time and then you could just easily pop them off. So what I did was I used the peel off base coat with some matte top coat on top and then I glued my tips and then applied the acrylic. Um, and I like, so far, I mean, I wanted to try this out to see how long it lasts because I do want to wear these for a little bit, not too long until I do the next video, which is definitely going to be some Halloween stuff so I can keep up with the trend <laughs> before Christmas comes up because Lord have mercy, they skipping Thanksgiving nowadays. But anyway, anyway, um, so I will have a video for that. So stay tuned for that video for popping off my nails so you can see how I pop them off and then definitely do some more nail art. So um, I'll let you guys enjoy the art part of the video and I will check in at the end.
Okay, doing my last finger with the top coat. Y'all, I had so much fun doing this set. I just love it. And anyone who knows me that I am extra with my nails. So you'll be seeing me a little bit more often doing extra stuff. Because look at this. Look at the boobs, y'all. They're so cute. The spider is so cute. I just love how this set came out. I enjoy doing this set. I hope you guys enjoyed the video. Please like, subscribe, and follow me on Instagram for more content. Until next time.